Guys, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Jeremy Blum. I make Arduino tutorials sponsored by Element 14. I, I blog for them and I, I do a bunch of other stuff too. Uh, but Element 14 is doing a thing now called Day in the Life of the Engineer. And they asked me to kind of show you guys where I do my work and uh, what kind of stuff I'm working on. So I'm just going to give you a quick once around of my uh, work area in my room. So, where to start? Um, Alright, so most important is the desk, obviously. You might notice I have a massive computer, which is, I can assure you, a pain in the butt to lug up to school every year. Uh, but it gets the job done. Quad core processor overclock, 3.5 gigahertz, uh, 4 terabytes of hard drive space, which I use to edit all of the HD videos that I'm sure you guys are watching, my Arduino tutorials and whatnot. Um, main desk area to do my work. I actually cleaned it off for this video. I know, amazing. I also have a laptop that I carry around. Also a pretty beefy quad core laptop with uh, all the best stickers on it. Uh, Weller soldering station, uh, my computer. Um, here's a Lowell Shield. Some of you might be familiar with it. Uh, attached to an Arduino. That's the front of my new business card. Calculator, obviously. Uh, some of you might know that I work for MakerBot designing electronics for the 3D printers. If you're not familiar with it, go check out MakerBot.com. But this is basically a uh, home 3D printer. You can see I have some plastic going into it now. It's not running right now, but uh, here's an example of something I printed with it. You might see these solder helping hands around that people use to help them solder stuff. Here's a, I, I lost the stand for it, so I printed out a new one, put my initials on it. That was printed out on this printer. Uh, a bunch of my tools, whatnot, more calculators. Down here, of course, we have the all-important toolboxes, more soldering irons, uh, Dremel. Everyone must have a Dremel. Uh, and then we go over here, got lots more plastic for my MakerBot, all kinds of fun electronics books. You might notice the Element 14 mug from the Open Hardware Summit, uh, as well as a couple of 3D printed objects that I have laying around. There's a little sculpture that's printed in PLA plastic. Um, this was actually printed on a commercial 3D printer, if, if you look at it closely. It's a uh, clock tower that actually has stairs on the inside. It's pretty awesome. Um, what else? Gotta have a multimeter, of course, important. Uh, some badges from stuff I've gone to Open Hardware Summit and Maker Fair. You might notice that whiteboard from my Arduino tutorials that I use, as well as uh, the video mic that I use to film those, uh, those videos and make sure the audio comes out good. And then down here is some more of the good stuff. You may have seen videos of my Sudo Glove hardware controller. Uh, on my YouTube channel, but here it is. Here's the car and the glove that you can put on to drive it around. If you haven't seen that, I encourage you to go check out the videos. But there's plenty more good stuff down here, too. We got jumper kits. Everyone should have one of these. Box of commons valued resistors. A uh, box of just a ton of assorted electronics. Uh, anti static mat, USB oscilloscopes. More wires and hookup connections and LEDs. Yet more electronic components and my go everywhere box of stuff. This includes most of the things that I use in my uh, Element 14 Arduino tutorials. All kinds of good stuff in here. We got a chip kit Arduino, five or six uh, different types of Arduinos in here, all kinds of shields GPS shield, Ethernet shield, uh, SD card readers, numeric keypads, all kinds of discrete components. Uh, speakers, all kinds of good stuff, uh, but this is the stuff I use in my videos, and that's basically uh, all of my engineering goodies in a nutshell. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, let me know if you have any questions or you want to see anything else.